welcome back to Hopper's Hot Rods or welcome for the first time if it's your first time here we're working on this uh, A-team van it's got an LS swap and it's a uh, terrible paint job but it's such a cool old vehicle everybody remembers the A-team van nobody remembers the A-team van old guys remember the A-team van anyway Got a lot to do. We'll start by making a list. I'll let you check it out. Okay, this thing is gonna need some work. Here's a problem. There's no rear wheel. There's no rear brakes. There's no rear axle. Not much going on back here. A little light in the rear end. Which means we have to bleed all the brakes. This could be trouble. Um, a lot of wires and the certainty of where they go is uh, uncertain. There's a, there's a beautiful LS engine right here. That's the Holly mid-mount accessory system. Very cool. Radiator's good. Electric fans. Air conditioning still plumbed in. But to take fuel in, you need an intake. There's no taking in without the intake. And there's no sparks without spark plugs. And no spark without the coils, which are also not present. So all that's gonna need to be addressed. And uh, fortunately, the way this van is set up, you can get to everything pretty easily. Underneath, there is a uh, transmission already mounted, excellent excellent news but there's also no exhaust pipes going to the engine so there's going to be exhaust on the list also and uh, before I can see any driving I suspect tires are in order because they are rather balding completely and there's a couple places you can see some of the air inside of the tire, I think. So, gonna need tires, but uh, you know, that's all. A rear end, drive shaft, intake manifold. We're gonna have to figure out some sort of throttle cable. This is the original throttle cable, is about a mile long, comes all the way out to here. And it's set up for a carburetor type. So, lots to do. A lot of wiring missing here. The other problem is going to be gauges. Because none of that's going to work with a modern LS engine. That's a speedometer cable type system. And we're going to have to have some electronic speedometer. You know, fuel gauge would be nice. I mean, I wouldn't say it's necessary, but it is certainly a luxury. We're going to see if we can get one in there. 